All right, guys, so we are going to see how this transformation turns out and if our barkeeper friend is the greatest friend we will have for this situation. Hey guys, welcome back for another video. We are back today to get some oven cleaning on oven is pretty awful it's just horrible it's all burnt we're gonna get in there we're gonna get it nice and clean barkeeper friend is everybody's friend we're gonna be using it we're gonna be getting in there and getting it nice and clean so i hope you guys are ready and here we go we're gonna get started so let's get to it so let's just get started so we have this oven that is just ridiculously dirty we see a lot of like burnt stains on the bottom which are going to be super hard to take off but you're going to see at the end how we do transform this oven back to what it was and let's just get started <laughs> Alright, so I had to use a lot of the Barkeeper Friend Powder. I literally just put so much on here, splashed some water on here, and then just started scrubbing. I also use some of my multi-purpose spray also to get in there and get some of these stains off. It did definitely take a lot of scrubbing, a lot of wiping, a lot of scraping to get this oven done. My scrubber did not survive. I had to toss it because it was just ruined, definitely ruined. You want to make sure that you are using like a dirty towel or something you're not going to care about because it will definitely get destroyed once you... <laughs> clean your oven so just use things you don't care about um i used some paper towels and i used my scrub which did not survive as i said before also i did use a old rag i had and that definitely did not survive either so i had to toss that as well but it was okay because at the end my oven was saved <laughs> voila so the door of the oven is finished it is nice and clean now we're gonna get to the hard part we are gonna work on these racks but i'm gonna put them aside for now and we are going to get into this oven <laughs> Like I said before, it took a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of this product to get this cleaned up. Does it do the job? We will see in a moment. But yes, it definitely took a lot of it to do what needed to be done. Let me show you what a good time looks like. You can do better, so much better. so i was not using fresh water to clean this 
oven. I was just using an empty water bottle, filling it up with some sink water and just splashing it into the oven. So much better. So as you can see, there was still stuff really, really stuck on this oven. Like it was stuck on there. It did not want to budge. So I had to get my handy dandy spatula guys. And I went in and I started scraping all this stuff out, trying to do the best I can to get all this stuff off. Be a little wilder, baby, kick your shoes off, don't hide it. scrape a little more try to get some of that black stuff off but it is crazy like I have all this stuff on my hands it was crazier than I thought it would be I knew it was gonna be crazy but not this crazy but I mean a lot of it did come off a lot <laughs> a lot did come off did I think it was gonna be perfect no but we're gonna finish this we're gonna get this finished I'm gonna try to scrape a little more out of here try to wipe it up as much as possible so let's get this finished up already and get this closed up now we are definitely seeing a difference the scraping is working a lot of that stuff did come off so i was pretty happy to see the results was it completely off no but it definitely was way way better i don't know what it is about you now i'm just working on the bottom the bottom is disgusting we're gonna get in there and we're gonna get this cleaned as well oh, now i'm moving closer to you and it's getting dark in this room tell me what you wanna do baby let me love you let me love you let me love you let me love you baby let me love you let me love you Voila, good as new. That definitely came out pretty good. Now I'm gonna go underneath this stove. It was gross. I'm not gonna lie, I was kinda scared. So I did put a glove on and I started getting all this stuff out of there, finding toys under there. It was ridiculous. You got me going oh, you got me going oh. Now I'm just going to the racks and I'm gonna start scrubbing the racks and getting them clean as well. I used some Dawn soap and also the, the Bar Keeper's Friend powder. Like I'm drunk on you. 
It feels like I'm drunk on ya It feels like I'm drunk on ya And there we have it y'all so you guys we got it cleaned up it's looking so much better than before the products i used did help so so much and i want to thank you guys for watching i will catch you guys in the next video bye